Hello everyone out there in YouTube land, my name is Brennan James Raymond, for those of you who don't know. This is my something thing th blog, no, vlog. I didn't check what number it was beforehand, but it will be on the name thing there. That one. There we go. Oh, you can see how organized I am. It's fantastic. Um... So, I haven't done a vlog in quite quite a while. I've been doing a couple of blogs here and there. I'll put the link down in the description. Um, but I haven't done much vlogging at all um, for quite quite a while, I think. I think the last... I put up Dear Old Me a little while back. Um, but that was from a fair while ago, actually. Um, and I think I might have put one up from early this year, maybe, or late last year, anyway, it's, it's been quite a while, um, but I had something in particular that I kind of wanted to talk about, so this isn't so much a catch-up sort of thing, more, I don't want to say rant, because it's, I'm not a ranty type person, for the most part, um, anyway, um, so, at the beginning of this year, I guess, there I had one one particular thing that I wanted to do this year um, was my album. So last year I did an album launch for About You, um, and that album was was kind of very different um, in in terms of of how it was done because it the way I'd written it was that every song kind of wove into the next one. And, and so I just sat down and played it all in one slot. Um, and so, and, and it was very much about the, the songs themselves and the words. And, and so what I actually ended up doing was recording it um, just at home and played it on the piano at home, which I'm pretty sure is very slightly out of tune, though it's in tune with itself, but it's, it's slightly out of tune. Um, and singing it at home, I think I had a cold at the time, um, and yeah, just all in one block, um, and then, you know, sending that off to get mixed and mastered and getting that on a CD, um, and then, yeah, I did the album launch with, with just that, um, so, you know, it was, it was fairly low quality, um, but I, at the, at the end of last year, you know, over the, over the course of last year, I'd actually been writing songs for a new album, um, which is called Living. Um, and, and at the end of last year, I had, I had all the songs written in. And so I was like, okay, I want, I want to, this time I actually want to re record these properly. I want to, you know, get, get people on board. I want to go into a proper recording studio and, and really get these down and, and make these sound good. Um, and, and so I had, I uh, talked to a friend of mine who had, had a recording studio and, and we talked about that sort of thing. And, and, and the idea was that, you know, this year I was, I was hoping that, you know, I'd, I'd get the whole album recorded and, and that, you know, somewhere at the end of the year, I'd be doing an album launch, um, was the hope. At the moment, it is the beginning of August. It is the 2nd of August when I am recording this. Hopefully it will also be up on the 2nd of August, but I don't know. Depends on how long you, it takes to upload to YouTube. Um, yeah, it's, it's the beginning of August, and I haven't finished recording the scratch tracks. Yeah. And, and that comes down to three things, really. That comes down to time and money and energy. Um, it comes down to time because time is not something that I have a lot of. <laughs> um, at the moment, you know, I, I'm involved in kind of a ridiculous number of things. Um, but the main thing that saps out my time is work. You know, I, I, I have to work, I work three days a week. Um, and, you know, th thankfully I have two days a week off, um, well, four days a week is weekend, but, but um, and so, you know, I, I do have probably a bit more time than most people, but I have a lot of other 
projects as well that I, I put a lot of time into. Um, but yeah, that th three days a week means that I don't have a lot of time left to work with. Um, and, and I have to work three days a week because of money. You know, I, I, you know, money doesn't just appear out of nowhere. And so I have to work three days a week so that I'm not just, you know, so I've, I've got enough money to get through the week. Um, and, and thankfully, you know, I still, um, I'm very lucky in that, I, well, fortunate in that I still live at home. And so my parents have been very helpful for me and, and, and I'm very thankful to them for all the things that they've um, been helping me with. Um, and, and, you know, I, I still, you know, get, you know, food every day and I don't have to pay for that really. And so that's, that's a big blessing to me. So, you know, at the moment, I don't even know if I'd be able to live out of home. Um, or if I think my budget would be stretched quite thin if I was living out of home. Um, cause at the moment I'm also putting money aside each week, um, towards a trip at the beginning of next year. A uh, band I mean Shalom is going on an India tour, so I'm kind of putting a lot of money towards that um, as well, um, and then some money into savings and that sort of thing. Um, so it, it goes away pretty quickly. So that's you know money, and then and then energy. You know, you, the, well the job I have kind of saps a lot of energy because it's a very physical job, you know, I'm working in a warehouse, um, which seem, probably seems strange to people who know me, I'm not a very physical person, but that's the job I have, um, it's it's a great place, you know, there's great people there, but it is a very physical job, um, so it, it does take a lot of energy out of me, and and so, you know, because, you know, I, because of these those three things, the time, the money, the energy, that has meant that I really haven't been able to do the work on this that I've, I've been wanting to do. Um, and that to me is really disappointing. Um, you know, particularly because, because for me, this, this is just one, one project, one idea. And, and there's so many ideas that I have so many ideas. Um, and, and, and so many projects and, and so many things that I'm like, oh, I could do this, I could do this, I could do this, I could do this. Um, and, and uh, you know, I'm, I'm a dreamer. That's, that's kind of what I do. Um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a creator. Um, and, and for me, it's, it's sad that a whole big, massive slab of, of my time has to go into just making money or my screen is on black as has to go into just making money um so that i can support myself um and 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 that that slab of time doesn't have any other you know it, it doesn't develop me in any way apart from that um i mean i mean i'm not saying that there isn't anything you get out of work and I'm not saying that I, I can't do any good there. I'm not saying that at all. You know, there's there's great things that you can learn from working and there's great things that you can do at work. Totally agree with that. But I, I think that there's a lot better things that I can do and I don't think that that the the sort of work that I'm doing is what I was made for, I guess. Um and 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 I and, and I find it sad, you know, that I, I feel like I'm I'm wasting all this time on doing doing things that that don't progress these these ideas and these dreams and and all these projects that I have. And 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 the problem is it's 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 something that's very hard to to get out of. Um, because, you know, you, you want, you know, obviously, you know, the idea is that, because, you know, you need money to get through from week to week. You know, that's just the world that we live in, unfortunately. Um, 
and so if 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 you want that and to be able to pursue what you do creatively then you need people to support you in in doing that and and for that you need to be recognized and to do that for that to happen you know usually or pretty much all the time you need to be putting in the time and energy to make that happen um and that's time and energy that i don't have and 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 that's kind of an infinite loop sort of thing which is which is kind of part of the issue you know i i can i can do bits and pieces and i do um but there's there's, there's only so much i can do particularly when i've got so many other things that I'm also involved in, um, which 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 is fine. You know, I love being involved in, in lots of things. That's kind of who I, who I am and who I, what I love doing. Um, and there's some great great things that I'm involved in, um, but it just makes it really difficult. Um, and I think there's there's a lot of other people as well, not not just me, that that have this problem. That you know. Uh, creative people um, who are stuck doing jobs and and work that doesn't that doesn't fit who they are that doesn't progress th- their ideas and their dreams and and who could be doing so much more I guess. Um, and I think that's one of the main things that, that I struggle with at the moment, knowing, you know, knowing, knowing that I could do so much and yet only being able to do this, <laughs> you know, this, this little bit here. And, and that's, that's what I really struggle with at, at the moment saying, you know, God, you've given me all of these gifts and talents and abilities and, and dreams and ideas and, and I can do butt kiss with it at the moment um and i know that he's he's got a reason and, and a rhyme for, for where i'm at and and i know um quite possibly that he's got some very different ideas to what i have um and and that's that's always always interesting and fun and <laughs> uh he 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 takes me to very interesting places sometimes um, and, and sometimes it's just being patient. Um, but yeah, that's, that's, I suppose, one of the things that I really struggle with at the moment. Um, and, and, and something I wanted to share a bit. So, um, I think that's it for me for now. Um, if perchance you would be interested in supporting me in my creative endeavors, I have a Patreon page where you can support me and support um, the little work that I am able to do. Um, I'll put a link to that below down there. Um, But otherwise, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope that you'll subscribe and look at my other videos and other stuff that I do have up. Um, Yeah, thank you.